I am now officially on summer holiday for seven weeks. I'm so happy. I can finally relax. I haven't been able to relax for a really long time. And the past week has been pretty busy. What have I been doing this past week, you may ask? Probably haven't asked, but I'm gonna tell you anyway. It all started on Thursday when I was at the train station to meet someone you have seen in these videos before. My friend Anna, who was visiting for an Edinburgh University Open Day, because we're grown ups and we have to make like decisions about life and stuff now and it's kind of worrying. So that was awesome. She stayed basically the whole weekend. Uh, we actually filmed a video. I have not watched back the footage of what we filmed yet so it could be that um, that all goes into its own separate video if any of it's salvageable. But to be honest, the most important part of what we filmed was this. Dude, that's a train of my pen in the picture that's in my what? brain. What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm never gonna let you live that down. So then, on Friday, we went to the Edinburgh Uni Open Day with two of my friends who actually live here. Uh, and basically I had an existential crisis because I went to a talk for a subject that sounded really dang good, even though it was not at all what I was planning on doing with my life. So now I'm trying to work out if I want to go to normal boring uni and study that, or if I want to do acting. Speaking of acting, then on Saturday, I was in a show. Um, which is good because I enjoy that. It went quite well. The dress rehearsal did not go as well. I tripped and fell. And then on Sunday, Anna left and it was very emotional and I cried over chicken nuggets. And then on the next Tuesday, I was at Taylor Swift. It was so good though. It was, it was like amazing. Ah. She had these lights and she did bad blood and it was just, yeah, it was so good. And then on Wednesday, I was at, wait for it, another concert. Yep, two concerts in two days because I, I live on the edge. This one was Adina Menzel. Um, I used to talk about her a lot in these videos, haven't talked about her that much, but the obsession is still there. She's still like amazing. I don't think I, I can say which out of the two concerts was better because they were so different. Like Taylor Swift was very like everybody standing up, dancing along, yelling the lyrics to Bad Blood. And then Adina Menzel was very like sitting down and quietly clapping when she's finished her like very emotional song. But they were both amazing. And then, because I was at two concerts in two nights, I was completely exhausted by Thursday and I actually brought a Red Bull into school with me because I'm a complete rebel. And then it was today, Friday, last day of term. It was a dress down day, so I got to really wear my 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 gay boy aesthetic, really. And we were raising money, so I spent the whole day making like pies that we could throw at teachers, which was quite entertaining. I was also in charge of the music. Well, when I say that, somebody handed me some speakers and I was like, Bagsy, I'm in charge. So nobody put me in charge, I just bagsied the speakers. And you know, it was going well. Played a little bit of Fall Out Boy and then this song just started playing and, and this girl turned around to me and she was like, is that One Direction? What? No. What? I don't have One Direction on my phone. I don't know what you're- Yes. And then Taylor Swift came on and I just like, I was wearing a red shirt over this t-shirt and I just ripped off my red shirt and I was just like, yeah. So now everyone in my school knows I'm T-Swizzle AF. If they didn't already. And then I finished off this week by watching the fucking Minions movie. I hate Minions with a burning fire of passion. I think they represent everything that is wrong with capitalism. Uh, and I would happily burn them in a fire. And I hate myself because I really liked that movie. So that has been my week. And now I have nothing to do. That's not true. I have a lot of stuff to do, but none of it's school related. So basically I'm happy. I'm gonna go and sleep for maybe 15 hours straight. So wish me luck and see you at some point.